Hi, welcome. I'd like to talk about superfoods for fighting the flu. Breakouts of the flu are responsible for millions of lost hours at both work and home each year. Not to mention many miserable days trying to recover. Some of us don't mind missing them, do we? If you're wondering what you can do to naturally boost your immunity and prepare your body's defenses, study the foods you're eating. Look at your family's meals. Make the changes needed to ensure everyone is eating a well-balanced diet, abundant in nutrient-dense fruits and vegetables, low-fat proteins, and complex carbohydrates. Black currants are even richer in vitamin C than oranges, containing approximately three times the recommended daily intake for adults. It's imperative that you get plenty of vitamin C since it helps prevent infections and helps keep the immune system healthy. Also, a person can take as much vitamin C uh, as possible. There is no limit. There are no bad side effects for taking an extreme dose of vitamin C. You just uh, urinate it out. You don't use it. So that's good to know. Pork has high levels of zinc and selenium, both of which help keep your immune system strong. Pork is also one of the best sources of B vitamins and contains only a little more total fat than beef. So, be sure to include lots of pork entrees in your menu planning. Uh, mix up your morning breakfast with a glass of grapefruit juice instead of orange juice for a vitamin C rich drink that's both sweet and tart. However, you should check with your doctor if you're on certain medications for blood pressure, AIDS, anxiety, or hay fever, as mixing grapefruit juice with certain drugs can lead to dangerous toxicity. Brussels sprouts are a great vegetable source of vitamin C are high in fiber and contain lots of folate as well. They improve anti-carcinogenic glucosinolates, which have important cancer-fighting properties. They're a great addition in a stew to provide lots of flu-busting nutrients. They're also delicious. Yogurt that includes live cultures has a positive effect on your GI tract and as a result helps the body purge the germs from the, from the body more quickly and effectively and fight the flu. You want your yogurt to contain the active culture L. acidophilus, which is also helpful in fighting off yeast infections. Potatoes are one of the most affordable sources of vitamin C and nicely complement any entree with their high levels of potassium and fiber. The skin contains the most fiber and the flesh just under the skin contains the most vitamin C. So eat your whole potato. Everything. <laughs> Fresh potatoes are the best source of vitamin C. Be careful of how you choose to prepare them, as soaking them in water robs them of their germ-busting vitamin C. You can bake them in an oven, and that's a delicious way. Whole wheat pasta is also rich in niacin, fiber, and iron. Its complex carbohydrates are an essential part of a healthy diet that will leave your immune system strong, to be strong. Simply substitute recipes uh, calling for traditional pasta with the whole wheat variety instead for a delicious and nutritious twist favorite pasta dishes. And if you're serious about enhancing your lifestyle with delicious superfoods and keeping healthy, check out this site right here. This site has helped and continues to help thousands of people live easier, healthier, younger, illness-free, and naturally balanced life. Indeed, spirits soar when we eat right. It's just a fact. And you can check out this site instantly by clicking the link in my video description below. This is Andrew Lumino, and thank you.